waiting, countless headlines and endless speculation, the biggest show on television is back. Do you worry at all about security? I've been nervous a couple of times. So has there been any bickering at all between any of you? Just yeah. wait. I mean, I totally choked Gary on one of the episodes. <gasps> you have judge loving going on now, you're getting on well, but surely that's going to change, or is it, when you all get split into your categories? And we've sent Anna Williamson to check out a British tradition. Certainly have. Well, good morning to you all. Yes, you couldn't get more British than this. I'm down at Earl's Court this morning, ahead of the British military tournament, which is kicking off this weekend. So I've come down to check it out. I've got all the gear. Find out exactly what I'm going to be doing after the break. Hey, guys, I'm Anna Williamson, and I'm here on the very British-inspired red carpet for the Arkiva British Academy Television Awards, exclusively for the BAFTA Kids Vote site. I'm glad the day has come, I must say. What will it mean to you to have one of those famous gold statues in your toilet? <laughs> in the toilet? It might be. So the red carpet's been going now for about half an hour here at the BAFTAs. Um, it is packed, as you can see. It is also a gloriously sunny day, which is brilliant, but I'm not going to lie to you. It's a little bit hot. They've dashed here straight from the set. Let's hear it for your hosts, the stars of Nickelodeon's Camp Orange. It's Jamie and Anna. Listen, folks, it really does give me great pleasure, great pleasure to introduce to you an international icon. She's a singer, songwriter, choreographer, model, dancer, actress. Please give it up for Kimberly Wyatt. One day, 11 hours, 55 minutes and 49 seconds. Yes, it's very, very exciting. Cannot wait for this. It's tomorrow, um, ITV1 at 8 o'clock. I've had a little sneaky peek of uh, the first episode, and I have to say it's an absolute corker. There's some really good characters in there. And uh, I, of course, met all the judges a couple of days ago. Uh, here's what they had to say about tomorrow night. Listen, our <laughs> special guest this morning um, is a lovely, lovely kids' TV star. It's the Anna Williamson, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> um, um, you're really passionate about kids, um, and that's why you're involved in a new campaign with Childline. I've joined Esther Ranson uh, on the Crusades to, uh, to help empower young people at Childline. Um, and I'm very proud to announce that I am now um, a fully-fledged Childline counsellor as well, so I do do my shift. Welcome to Wrongtown and the final day at Camp Orange. All week, our campers have experienced relentless challenges and unyielding wrongness. But today, they must harness all of their strengths as they face the ultimate test. Today is the Wrong Town Mega Challenge. At Campfire tonight, you know the drill by now. We will, of course, be adding together all of the scores earned on this challenge with the challenge you did earlier on this morning. And, of course, we will be announcing who are the winning team for today. Uh, and Anna's around. Are you around, Anna? Certainly am. Look, look, look where I am. They've let me loose. They let me out of the studio into uh, the nerve centre of Telly Towers. And yes, we're doing TV Matters in just a few minutes. Reacting to Educating Essex, which was on last night. So uh, let us have your thoughts. You've got just a couple of minutes to get them in. And uh, we're talking everything else to do with the weekend's telly as well. See you in a bit. Merry Christmas. <laughs> now, throughout the year, we've given away some amazing prizes, but nothing quite as big as this week's Christmas competition. Now, to celebrate this momentous occasion, we've invited some of this year's winners to London for a bit of a Christmas party and tell us what it's like to win with Daybreak and the Rain. It's how Lewis Hamilton started his dream. Reaching speeds of up to 55 miles an hour. With your backside just inches from the ground. That's right, today's Whiskers is all about karting. Billy is definitely a whiz kid, but to prove that karting is not just for boys, it's time I took to the tarmac. Good morning, everybody. Now, we're getting very festive this morning. Can you believe it's exactly 75 days until Christmas Day? So, we're getting nice and festive in Dulwich Picture College today. We've got the carol singers, we've got the kids, because we're launching our Art Stars competition. Could your child be the next Picasso? Well, all the details coming all morning. We've got Joe Swash helping us out and Neil Buchanan. We're so up for it. See you after the break, right, kids? Yeah! <laughs>